it's really special to, to be able to create from scratch. And, and it does, it comes through you. When I'm done with the commission, this sounds kind of extreme, but you almost feel like you've given birth. People think that artists just sit around and have fun all day, and that is not the truth. You know, we work very hard and we reach deep inside to get that creativity to come out. My name is Lark Abel. I live in Crawford, Colorado, in the North Fork Valley, and I do carved and etched architectural art glass, and I've been a working artist since I was 18 years old. I'm mostly self-taught. I have studied under people, but I'm self-taught. My dad, who was a very successful architect, that's one of the greatest things that he gave me, was an ability to understand line and space and create elegance and do something very simple and have it be beautiful. And he influenced me in that way. He also in influenced me in the way that he worked with people because he was always had a lot of integrity with his clients and he was at ease with them, which put them at ease. And so that's kind of a family trait that, thank God, I inherited and, and I appreciate very much. One of the, the really fun things about carving glass, since it is so industrial, is I go into the booth and I'm suited up and I'm encapsulated in this suit and so I'm doing very fine, fine artwork in a very industrial situation. When I'm carving the glass, I'm pulling up one piece of tape at a time. And I'm watching the glass sparkle up in the air and be removed, and I'm actually sculpting away the glass. I get to peel off the tape off the eyes and peel off the tape on the whole piece. And when I do that, then the entity comes through the glass. And for carving for me, that's the most fun that I have, uh, working with glass in that way. One of the things that I, I would say is my signature is my attention to detail and my ability to make something look real on glass. I really love to do that. I'm learning now to simplify a little bit because it's more popular right now to be more contemporary and simple and elegant lines, which I like doing, and having it look real, which is very fun under the circumstances of which I work, which is very industrial. Always, with all my work, I, I want people to just see the beauty. Maybe it'll make them feel calm, or maybe it'll make them be introspective. But in the future, I'd like to do work that makes people see who they really are inside. I mean, the true, absolute beauty of all of us inside themselves. And that's important to me. How I'm going to do that, I don't know yet, but I, I really look forward because art really does change the world and I would like to be a part of that. This episode of Beyond the Gallery is made possible by Colorado Creative Industries, the Betcher Foundation, and the National Endowment for the Arts.